so long, Judas. Poor old Judas. Yeah. Um, we're pimping Peach's ride um, because she hurt her leg and she had to go in this really boring wheelchair. So, as fabulous as Stray hairs. It's beautiful, isn't it? That's okay. You guys are in? Okay, cool. Hi. Hi. I'm Fletcher. Fletcher, hi. Yeah. Yes, we met before. How are you? I'm good, I'm good. Well taken care of. Yeah. Yeah. You look cozy. Let's go, let's go! So how are you Peaches? How's it going? How do you think I am? Do we need to discuss this, maybe? Kids at home, even if you're a professional, you have to be careful. But I told my dad that I twisted my um, leg not to worry because, you know, he's in Canada and everything. And he said, all good athletes get injured and I see you as one of the best. He sees me as an athlete. That is so, so good. that's sweet, huh? Sweet. So can I ask what happened? I don't want to dwell on it too much, no, but no, I think no. we need to just cover it. All right, give me the mic, give me the mic, give me the mic. I'm a mic hog, sorry. Um, I, is that okay on your, are you okay with no, that? Yeah, I, uh, hello. I uh, jumped off a very, hey, how are you? <laughs> yeah, um, I jumped off a very high drum kit riser in a costume that I couldn't see out of which had stuff all over my legs. It was just a little, a lot going on. I keep adding more and more stuff and I think um, I just, I reached my limit actually. Peaches reached her limit for, for the day anyway. So, but you know, you just make a new whole thing out of it, don't you? So. Um, who made this for you? Was it Charlie? Um, uh, it w actually, it, it was Alon. Okay. Alon and Richie, very good friends of Charlie. I, I, to be honest with you, I think it's looking pretty cool. Like I, I, I think you blagged it. I think that um, in general, all artists want to do a show in a wheelchair. I've thought about it. Actually, my sister is in a wheelchair, so I wouldn't want to fake that because I just doesn't really, you know, faking it. Your sister's really in a wheelchair. But, you know, if I've got a reason, then uh, I'm going to rock it. So are we going to dedicate it to maybe your sister? I'm going to dedicate it to my sister. And actually, we're going to... Um, this will become an item for uh, uh, up for uh, auction for multiple sclerosis. Oh, really? Okay. Is this a charity that you ha you're involved in, or? Yes, that's what my my sister has multiple sclerosis. So um, I would like to raise money for that by auctioning off this lovely chair. Okay. So if anyone's watching and they fancy this in the, at home, mm -hmm. then we need to get in contact with who? You can um, contact me at uh, www peachesofficialblog.com well that's the, the you know blog website or www.peachesrocks.com and there's some uh, contacts there you can you know inquire we should say that it should start at 500 pounds I mean that's I think maybe we want a little bit more than yeah, yeah, I'm thinking a couple of grand at least I know that's cheap all right so we're gonna start at um, 10,000 10, pounds yeah much better, much better. So, sorry, I, I have to, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm apologizing to my sister for like, you know, just giving under, under, underselling it. So, can we maybe talk about your music? Sure. So, we um, are we on the fourth album now? Yeah, we're we're finished the fourth album now, and and we're in my um, theater phase. So, um, I, I've just finished doing Peaches. Christ Superstar, which is my interpretation of Jesus Christ Superstar as a one-woman show where I um, sing all the roles of the characters from Pilot to Jesus to, um, you know, Mary to Judas and um, I do it in a very minimal, fantastic way with, with, with Gonzalez, Chili Gonzalez doing uh, the whole orchestra on piano. So are you adapting the music from the musical? Uh, it's exactly the musical, and I'm just doing it straight up for the love of it. Um, and I also just worked out an opera that I took 20 songs from my collection, uh, from the um, 
four albums and I've, I've reconstructed the order of them to uh, to to make a proper opera out of it from start to finish not using any uh, extra lyrics or extra uh, words just using the words from my song I've made a, a proper opera that will include love lost, descend into madness, all the classic um, you know, selling your soul to the devil, tale of um, you know greed, all, all those classic themes without it being like moving out or Mamma Mia or you know one of those uh, Broadway shows that, that it can actually function on a main stage. Um, what's your favorite song and are we allowed to have maybe a very very small excerpt? My favorite song in the world, or my own song, or what? I well, I was thinking maybe more from um, Jesus Christ Superstar. Oh, oh. All right. Um, you, can, you can take the mic. Okay. You have murdered me, murdered me, murdered me, murdered me. So long, Judas. Poor old Judas. That was peaches, everyone. Can we just have a little round of applause for that, please? Um, I This album, I'm, I'm actually more rapping than I've ever done, more singing than I've ever done, both like ethereal singing, soulful singing. Um, there's just a lot of variety. And the first time I collaborated with different producers and... Um, I love it. I'm really happy. It, it actually, I couldn't have had the opera without it. I'm telling you all that for, for this opera, it was really important to have this album because there's, there's other elements that, that took it deeper. It's all the uncovering of me, really, all this. What's inside? What is inside? I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out. Okay. So can, can we talk about maybe your style, your clothes? Because um, something I admire about you um, is the way that you look and the artwork that you use, the videos that you do. Um, and is this a creation, is this all your own creation? Or do you have people that help you? Well, I don't think anybody is an island in this situation. And I think that um, in situations like today, it's amazing how many people you can, who, um, you know, who share, share your vision or can, can help you out, like, like Alan and Richie and you know, Charlie and um, uh, like Johnny Wu, who's going to join on stage and um, and Laura, who, who made my first triple X cape, is going to come and roller skate on stage. And, um, you know, I, I just really it's all about it's, it's actually for me. What's amazing is building a community like on, on a level like, OK, something goes wrong and then you can just make something new about it because you have a community. So, I mean, when you first started out, was it was it always? Did you always want to be kind of an avant-garde performer? Did you have major icons that you kind of looked up to? And do you well, still have icons them, now? Yeah, one of them's here today, Grace Jones. I mean, it's kind of a typical one, but it really, I really was obsessed in high school and listened to her a lot. So I'm really excited to see her. Do you know Grace? I've met her once. I hugged her. I cried. So maybe we can try and set a little meeting up with you two today. Yeah. I, you know, I hugged her, I cried. That's good enough for me. <laughs> um, one of your most famous songs is Fuck the Pain Away. Uh -huh. uh, that song to me reminds me of being maybe 18 uh -huh. and dancing in my friend Tommy's living room yeah. with my friend Charlotte. Uh -huh. And to me that was about kind of being young and just finishing school and going to St. Martin's and doing that whole thing. What does that song mean to you? Um, it's, it's really, I wanted it to be like an anthem for that exact reason. So, perfect. Okay, it's been really lovely to meet you. Nice Thank you very much for talking to me. It's Peaches, everyone! <laughs> Making everybody. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank Thank you. you. Nice to meet you. You too. So.